All right, about 13 and a half in. We're going to end up stopping up here at Hillaby Creek. Uh, I think Brendan's feeling pretty loose, pretty pretty bad. Uh, he normally is right behind me, and every time we get started today, he just falls behind. So. All right, we are heading back to the trail now. Such a good stop. Such a good stop. Now we just got to make it across this road. <laughs> Alright guys, we are in section 7 now. I didn't even realize. So the Chiaha Trailhead the end of section six. So we've got two miles to the Blue Mountain Shelter. I believe it's three miles to the Blue Mountain, unless they're next to each other. I can't recall at this point. But yep, we're gonna grind it out, Blue Mountain. So we'll see y'all there. So we're stopped here at the Ball Junction um, Spur Trail Junction. Young Buck's not feeling well. He's going going to hell in a handbasket. That's what happens when you go to heaven. So yeah, we're feeling a little low, a little tired, a little hot, a little worn out. Brandon said he's feeling a little nauseous. So we're going to try to rehydrate and. We're going to try to make it about six and a half more miles and camp out there for the night and hopefully get to feeling better in the morning. All right, well, a um, little bit back down the trail, I was feeling like shit. I went up a straight up hill a few times and I don't know, I just feel my legs wouldn't want me to keep going. Felt a little nauseous, a little bit dehydrated. But once we got to the beginning of Blue Mountain, we kind of just hung out. And now I guess we're just going uh, straight downhill. Put some noon energy tablets and a uh, propel in my water. So hopefully that helps a lot. Hopefully that kicks in and I'll just fly over the trail. Yeah, we're, we might find a uh, earlier camp spot. We might not go to Friendship Camp. Um, there's a couple. Um, Little Hillaby we might camp at. And there's one other one. But yeah, I guess we'll see how we feel. Um, six miles in i mean if we feel great i mean two more miles that ain't nothing anyway we're gonna keep on going so far section seven is pretty tough but i like the challenge i think i'm starting to feel a little bit better now so moods are up just keep on walking yeah i think i might need to get into uh better shape Cause I'm, I'm strolling along fine on like uh, decently graded hills and of course flat. Now downhill's a little tough, but I mean it's not as bad as you know the steep hills we've gone through. Just the grade is basically just straight up and oh, I'm not used to that. So we're just slowly going down. So we're just gonna slowly keep going. We're in Zulu Canyon right now. We crossed this, um, I think it was Chiaha Road. But I think from here we're two and a half miles from camp. We thought it was four, but I looked back and apparently it's three miles. So that'll be nice. All right, about 13 and a half in. We're gonna end up stopping up here at Hillaby Creek. Uh, I think Brendan's feeling pretty loose, pretty pretty bad. Uh, he normally is right behind me, and every time we get started today, he just falls behind. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I'm ready to get to camp, man. These hills are just killing me. 
If I see another hail, I'm gonna fucking flip out. Huh, you probably can't hear it. If I hear a creak. Now that means throw my bag down and lay down. I really, really fucking hope that this is the camp up here. God, I really hope. Oh, let's hope. Oh, well, the water over here, from what I can see, looks big enough to be a like a creek. I know we're close to the creek. I'm, I'm really hoping that tail will be over there. Oh man. I'm ready for this day to be over with, to be honest. Oh, twist my ankle for the fourth time. <sighs> yep, a little sour. All right, I heard a woody woo. You know what that means? He's probably stopped the camp and seen how far I am. I hope that's the case. I hope. I know I've said this like 20 times, but I'm ready to get to camp. I was right. I was coming up on the camp spot. I thought they were going to go up a little bit further. They were going to go ahead and cross this creek. And maybe our next camp spot will have some cell service too because we don't hear. So yeah, we're going to cross this and hopefully find camp soon. I guess I'm just going to say fucking get my shoes wet. All right, so it's been a little while since I checked in. As you can see, Young Buck's not making it out too high. He's hurting pretty good. We ended up doing about 15.2 to get here. We're camped probably eight miles away from the car. And uh, yeah, I'm just hanging out, chilling while he takes a little nap. Hopefully he feels better when he wakes up. Poor guy. <laughs> All right, guys, it is 7.45 right now, and I'm actually starting to feel a little better. I felt terrible when I got to camp. Nauseous, dizzy, weak. So I just, like, put up all my stuff and, like, napped for maybe, like, 30 minutes. But as I was waking up, I felt a little bit better, less nauseous. Started feeling hungry, so that's a good thing. So I'm cooking, or I'm cooking some ramen. You can't see it. It's definitely helping. It's definitely delicious. I kind of wish I brought two of them because I would definitely eat two of them or three of them for sure. But I guess all I can do now is um eat, stay hydrated, eat some more, and um, we'll bust out these nine miles tomorrow. All right, we're back to it. Another day. Got eight and a half miles to the car. We got one good big climb in the morning, which is good. <clears throat> I don't mind doing them in the morning. Just after like 14 miles is when I get tired of them. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna conquer these last few climbs, get to the car, and either go to Waffle House, Popeyes, then go to REI, and head it to the house. Let's finish section seven. <laughs> So, so far, section seven after Hillaby Creek is pretty, it's like a roller coaster. Lots of ups, some downs, mostly ups. Going up right now. Well, it's probably gonna be like this the whole rest of the way, but I'm feeling a lot better. I feel a lot more hydrated and I have a lot more energy. So, shouldn't be too much of a problem getting through this. Section seven, eh. Nothing really pretty to look at, you know, just going through a green tunnel in the deep woods. I'll tell you what, it is a challenge. Up and down, up and down. I'm excited to get to Friendship Board. I'm ready to see what we missed out on, because I'll tell you what, I couldn't have done that last night. I couldn't have gone there. Uh-uh.
I think that's the waterfall actually. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking uh, something bigger. Well, we just got done with a big old climb. I think we climbed a thousand feet. So glad I feel up to do it because I just, I blew it. I did it. Went up there like it was nothing. Had a really good warm up this morning. So that's probably why I got this momentum going. But I got my trail legs back, thank God, because yesterday, I don't know what was going on with me. Well, yes, I do. I was dehydrated and really didn't eat a lot. But you know what the cure for that is? Ramen noodles and liquid IV and Mio. And a nap. I took like a little 30 minute nap. That helped a little bit. Oh, but anyway, I think we're just under four miles from the car. So that's good. So I will see y'all over there. Here comes the sun. Do, 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 do. Here comes the sun. It's gonna get hotter. Do, na, 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 na. Yeah, it's been a little gloomy all morning. It's really cloudy. It did rain a little bit last night at camp, just a little trickle. I didn't hear it rain hard. But at first it said thunderstorms and then it said showers and it didn't last too long. The trail's not too wet. All my stuff ain't too wet. But I hope that sun just stays behind the clouds just a little bit longer, just until we get closer to the car. Cause we're on top of a peak, I think. So it might, I don't want direct sunlight right now. All right, let's keep on going. Came across a barrel. Habitat. Okay, I will say towards the end of section seven, it's actually uh, worth all the challenges we just went through. Look at that. See a uh, couple small ones, and then this big one came on through. But yeah, towards the end of section seven is kind of worth it. There's water all the way along. See a couple waterfalls. Not too bad. So yeah, okay, this redeemed it for me. I don't hate section seven all that bad. <laughs> I guess we're gonna keep on going. I think we're just under three miles away from the car. So hell yeah, let's get it moving. Woo! Fantastic. Orgasmic. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we are two miles away from the car and I have service here so I looked up there with a Chinese buffet and there it is. So we're gonna stink up that place and eat up all their food. <laughs> yeah, two miles. Get there in under an hour. Let's go. Okay, 
Okay, I thought I had it a little further. But I think I see my car. It is. I see. Fuck yes. Oh, that went by quick. I thought I still had a little bit more to go. Oh, nice. Nice. Now it's off to the Chinese buffet. And... Oh. This is our prize. Yummy.